Why, hello. What's going on, everybody? On today's episode of Stoner Chef, we're going to make a pulled pork pot pie. We're going to try to, at least. Try. So right now, we're going to try to make this crust. Uh, <clears throat> I've never made a crust before, so this should be fun. Uh, right here, I have two and a half cups of flour and a tablespoon. Was it a tablespoon? I'm sorry. Teaspoon of salt. My apologies. So I'm going to add this to the bowl like so. And then I have six tablespoons of cold butter cubed. I'm gonna toss that in like so. Then three quarters of a cup of shortening. Well, the recipe called for shortening. Uh, I'm using coconut oil because it's pretty much damn near the same thing. Oh shit. Do you hear that? Hold on. I'm doing laundry, I th and uh, my laundry room is right there. Anyway, sorry about that. So I added the butter and coconut oil shortening into the bowl, and then it says to use a pastry cutter and stuff to like blend it in. I don't have a pastry cutter, so I'm just going to use forks, the, you know, the lady on the website said you could, so that's what I'm going to do, and I'm just going to smush it up, and this is going to be a pain in the ass. Break it up with your hands. <laughs> like, it's so much easier that way. And it's really the coconut oil that's the hardest. Like, the butter, even though it's cold, it's easy to cut through. The coconut oil, man? That's not. Ugh. La da 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 da. It's the motherfucker stoner chef. I have my pulled pork. Okay. Okay. It forms a nice ball. All right. So. I'm gonna quick 
uh, get a surface a little flowery, and I'm going to transfer it to that. All right. So we'll be right back. All right, so I have my flowered surface, and I'm going to flower my hands. Then we're just gonna make this one big ball. Make a ball, let it fold out, fold it into itself. Just like you would with other dudes. Wanna make sure everything's well and the See the little fat in there? The website says that's okay, so I'm hoping it's okay. Then what we're gonna do is cut it in half. My fucking, my vision sucks, so like. Into like a around a one inch thick circle, like dope pad, like so. Do it with the other one. Okay. One minute. Pop them in the fridge for about two hours. It says. Then over here, we got the pull pull going. All right. So we'll be back in a little while. I gotta like cool off or something. Doing all that fucking shit. Anyways, uh, you got. All right, folks, and we're back. Uh, I got my dough. It's been chill for almost three hours. Looks like a big ass cookie. We're gonna try to roll this on bitch out. Got my pie dish right here. Off. Flour surface. I'm gonna just get both sides of it real quick in the flour. Could you tell? I'm really trying. 
and uh, I went to get root beer or whatever. I can only find birch beer, so that's what I use. Birch beer. Uh huh. Uh huh. Preheat the oven to full point five. You're gonna beat that egg. You're gonna beat it like a hillbilly beats his wife after drinking a few Paps Blue Ribbons. Just kidding. gonna let the oven preheat it looks monstra it looks hideous absolutely hideous look at this shit look at this shit it looks hideous normally you would cut a slit in it right but i don't need to because it's kind of broken so there's gonna be plenty of room to fucking vent so <laughs> so i'm gonna pop this monstrosity in the oven and we're gonna cook it until it's like golden brown Woo. until it's like golden brown or whatever and uh And uh, probably like maybe 20 minutes, half hour, I'd say. So we'll check out it soon. And uh, so stay tuned. So it looks pretty despicable looking. But uh, <laughs> I'm not Gordon Ramsay, so fuck it. I'm the stoner chef, Urj. And uh, this is my first time making a motherfucking pie crust for a pulled pork. So this is my first pot pie. First pie crust and a pulled pork pot pie. So it's like three firsts in one. You know what I mean? So yeah, it looks a little despicable, but I don't give a fuck. Thank you guys for joining me for this episode. Uh, actually, I should let you know how it turns out. That's what I'll do. I'll let you know how it turns out, and then I'll say goodbye. Yeah, all right. So that was actually pretty goddamn good. Uh, I think I need some work on my crust skills, and that's okay. Um, but yeah, it was pretty good, man. The crust wasn't bad tasting. I just feel like it was a little... I don't know what word I'm looking for. It's not dry, but it just seemed like it broke apart real easy, and I don't know how I'd be able to fix that. Maybe the pastry thing would have helped more if I was able to break the fat up into smaller pieces than I was able to. Um, I don't know. But uh, other than that, it tasted good. And it was, it was nice, you know? Um, 
so yeah, definitely good shit. And I have more ideas for Popeyes, so I'm gonna definitely try to work on my crust skills. Maybe I'll make a real pie too, like a banana cream pie or something. That would be delicious. Um, or like a chocolate pudding pie. Oh yeah. Anyways, um, thank you for watching this episode. Peace.